Did you make a fake statue? Dorvin Dad? Oh, that'd be Dirk. <laughs> it's very good work. Just what did I expect from Dirk? Who's my main in Smash Brothers? Um, Fox, usually. And, um... Oh gosh, what's that name? One of the newer ones from... Fire Emblem has the Lance, whatever their name is. Dad, just what about... Just what kind of jobs are you doing? Well, then, what shall we do? You think the fake will fool the old man? Doesn't seem likely. It's well built, but it's still fake, as is the diamond. How about if we just go get the real one? You want to go all the way to Thoda Island? And on top of that, the other rocky area is on the other side of the geyser, correct? Yeah. Problem's the geyser. Even I'll pass on getting hit by boiling water. Oh my lord, you remember that a geyser erupts with boiling water? Oh, so proud. Your mains are Cloud and Bayonetta. Nice. Lloyd, you're amazing. Of course. Everyone knows that. I bet you just guessed. Shut up! Hmm. If only we could stop the geyser. I've heard that the eruption cycle of Photo Island geyser is quite short. I wonder if we can seal it with something. That's it! We'll have Gina seal it with magic. How? Like, cover it with ice or something. Okay, I'll give it a try. You better be grateful. Dwarven vow number one. Let's all work together for a peaceful world. Which is weird, because later it says do things by yourself. Mr. Genius Magician. Oh, I need to put... I need to activate his other stuff in case he needs, like... Usages. And to get the newer things. Okay. Um, so we're going to the human ranch, I think. I think I see it there on the map a little bit. Other side of the mountain, so down this way. You're going down. Ow. If I equip him with the poison charm, will the poison go away? No. Well, fine. You're going down. There's nobody there, bro. We are hitting a lot harder. Did I level up? Is that what that was? I think that's what that was. Let's save right outside of it just in case. Bunch of mages. <sighs> the second ranch. Lloyd? Yeah, we've seen this before. So Azalea wasn't the only human ranch. It just seems so wrong that that's even allowed. I don't even want to see any more victims like Marble. Well, yeah, we don't need any more victims. Let's go, genius. Ikimashou! Um... Please wait. Neil, we heard Chocolate's been kidnapped. Yeah, I wish to speak with you regarding that. Please come this way. Doesn't sound like you have very good news for us. 
Lucky all to just go ahead and leave the Palma Costa region. What happened to Chocolat? We're supposed to work in conjunction with the Palma Costa army to save Chocolat, right? No, that's... So it's a trap. Of the several possibilities, it looks like the worst one came true. Kratos, Professor, what are you talking about? It was a mystery that the designs would simply leave a city with an army alone. Exactly. Chosen, choosing not to crush the seeds of rebellion must mean they are not a threat. They are left alone simply because they have no real power, perhaps because they are in fact beneficial. It is as you say. Dor is working with the designs to lead the Chosen into a trap. Why would he do such a thing? He didn't used to be like this. He always thought of the well-being of the people of the city. Even five years ago, when he lost his wife, Clara, he swore to fight against the designs. Then why? I don't know. At any rate, entering the ranch will now be now put the Chosen in danger. Leave Chocolat to me, and please go on your way. Please regenerate the world as soon as possible. Indeed, it would be best to abandon the situation here for world regeneration. No, I can't just ignore this. Chocolat's right. Or Colette's right, because I can read. If we leave things now as they things as they are now, Palma Costa may be destroyed just like Isalia. You think so too, don't you, Lloyd? Yes, what you say is true, but I still wish to side with Kratos. If you don't want to see cities destroyed, you should avoid contact with the designs. Duh. <clears throat> hmm. That's not right. Regenerating the world and saving people in front of us are not exclusive to each other. That's what I think. If that is how you feel, Colette, then we do not have any right to stop you. The only one who has the right to make decisions on this journey is you, the Chosen One. Is that all right with you, Lloyd? That was my intention from the beginning. Remember what I said? I'm going to destroy them all. Uh, still. It's all right. Colette is saying that this is what she wants. Now then, we have two courses we can take. The first one is to, is to go on ahead and infiltrate the ranch and rescue Chocolate and the other captives. Now that things have come to this, if we leave the ranch alone, it will surely result in a second Isalia. Our second option is to confirm Dor's true motives. If he was, if he has planned a trap, then he knows the layout of the ranch well. Let's talk to him for a bit. What are you going to do to Dor? You'd better not ask that. Rain's punishment is painful. See? Thinking logically, dealing with Dor first is the correct choice. What do you think, Lloyd? Palma Costa. Let's return to Palma Costa. We'll hear what Dor has to say first. Yeah. Let's save Chocolate as soon as we can. I'm sure she's scared and lonely. My, even Lloyd makes a rational decisions sometimes. See, so it seems. Well then, let's go. What should I... Stay here. We're gonna go put a squeeze on your commander. It's better if you don't see it. Please watch over the status of the ranch from here. All right. <laughs> You're about to hit 8K, need 90 more. Don't worry. I don't know who's actually next in line to redeem the friendship points for um, cosplay. How are we doing on... Um... Okay. They're all decently far from leveling, so I'll go ahead and just run there. Oh, 10k? No, the the redemption for um, cosplay is 100k. Yeah, they die in two swings. Or two little combos, as opposed to like five. Yeah, then you'll be a tenth of the way to cosplay, exactly. You can do it, Blade. How much experience did I get from that? I don't have any of keeping track. Okay, so there's four of you. Oh, that seems awesome! Like that? 
I want beast. What am I gonna replace it with though? Never stood a chance. I might not need to replace it actually. I think I have another space. Yeah, I do. Level two, slam battle energy into and blow it away. Cool. I'm remembering something, hold on. You can combo those, right? One to two. I think you can. Let's give it a shot. Defeat Magnus is what this is. That Magnus is a barbarian. It has really Rastafarian hair. I couldn't have put it better myself. He's trying to rule everything through brute force. And the power he's using to do it isn't even his. It comes from his X-Sphere. That jerk. I'm gonna make him pay. Even that man is a living being. Defeating Magnus means taking a life. So, what? We just stand by and let him take out his retribution on people in the Hollow Costa? No, what I'm saying is to kill your enemy means to bear the responsibility for that life. And you must never forget that. To bear responsibility for a life. Yeah, you're right. Seems like I get excited a little too easily. I'll be careful. But you quickly realize it and repent, so you're still fine. And then he quickly forgets, too. Hey, don't butt in! Ow! Okay, I want to see this. Oh. Don't you guys let up? Yes, I can. Now hold on, how do I? He's not. Hit... I feel like he should be hitting the first one too. Yeah, there we go. Ba Bam. Oh gosh, I'm using all my tech points for it, but it works. I don't want to hear Dwarven Bow number seven. Okay, great. Combos are working. Also, how are we looking on 26 and 100? Yeah, let's let's fight this guy real quick. That's two levels. Reinforcements, huh? Beast is expensive, man. Like that? Work. <laughs> That was just warming up. Nice, double level up. That's what I wanted. And then we can uh we'll rest and go talk to the dude. What are you doing, Colette? Oh, I'm praying for safety of the people of Silveron. I see. I've always done it my whole life. It feels strange if I don't. You're sure devoted. I guess we shouldn't expect any less from the Chosen. Colette, best wife. A little sniffly. Weird. There's no one here. I think I hear voices from below. Really? I don't hear anything. There's no one here. We should head down to the basement. Are there any secrets? Any chefs? my wife uh, when will Clara return to her original form not yet you still haven't paid us enough gold you've been paying us less and less this is the best I can do the tolls the municipal taxes the offerings to the church of Martell there's nowhere left to squeeze more money from well I suppose this will do for today 
I'm sure Lord Magnius will remove the demon seed depending on your next contribution. Father? Just a, a little while longer. Just a little more and, and Clara will be back to normal. I'll raise the fees on the pilgrimages and... What's the meaning of this? Oh, what's the matter? You look like you just saw a ghost. Um, Lloyd, that's a really cliched line. It is really cliched, but it's also accurate. Shut up, Genus. What are you doing here? Neil, where's Neil? I'm afraid Neil's not here. So, Neil betrayed me. What's wrong with your wife? Has she been taken hostage or something? Hostage? Don't make me laugh. If you want to see my wife, she's right here. <sighs> oh, wh what's that monster? She's crying. She's crying out in pain. You mustn't call her a monster. See you later, Blade. You don't mean... That's right. This is what's become of my wife, Clara. What's that sound? So that's why you told everyone she passed away. My father, the previous governor general, was a fool. Because of his defiant stance against the Desions, they killed him. Then planted the demon seed in my wife as a warning. If I cooperate with them, they will give me the medicine to save her. But that means you're betraying the people of this city. What do I care? We'll never escape the rule of the Desions anyway. Colette will. The Chosen will save the world. The Chosen's journey of world regeneration is not absolute. Don't forget that the last one ended in failure. Besides, the people of this city are satisfied with my way. Your way is lying and being a jerk. They just don't know I'm working for the Desions. Shut up. What do you mean, your way? I'm sorry about your wife. But think of all those people who believed in you, only to be sent off to the ranch. Any of them may have wound up just like your wife. Silence, boy! Stop acting like your justice is absolute. Where do you get off? Don't even start spewing the word justice. I hate that word. If you wanted to save your wife, you should have resigned your position as governor general and searched for a cure or help or whatever. You're a worthless jerk who couldn't give up his social status even for his own wife. Lloyd, please stop. Not everyone's strong enough to stand up against the designs. Oh, it's rain. Please. Stop this. That was the sound I was hearing. Colette. That's a lot of rain, too. What if we go and get the medicine you mentioned? Then you wouldn't have to side with the designs anymore. You forgive me for what I've done? It's not our place to forgive you. That's up to the people of this city. But I know Martel will forgive you. The goddess Martel is always within you. Awaiting your own personal regeneration. Within me? Absurd! Yeah? The goddess Martell would never lend her aid to an inferior human being. Oh, you're not who you... Okay, yeah. What are you I doing? Forgot. How could you do that to your own father? Hustle-lap! I am a servant of Pronima, leader of the five grand who rule over the design. I was merely assigned to observe the new human cultivation technique developed by Magnus. There's no way that a superior half-elf such as I could have a fool of a father like this. You're a weird-looking half-elf. You're more like an imp. A uh, fool of a father? Just look at him. He didn't even notice that his own daughter was dead. He was too busy chasing after medicine that doesn't exist in order to save his monster wife. <laughs> you. How could you? Yeah, you about to die. This is a dangerous situation. Sword ring! Work! Hellhammer! 
Dude, you hit that much? Dude, are you in a corner? Don't overdo it. Ow! Get off a of genus. Oh gosh! You turned into Diablo. Don't overdo it. I'm waiting. I think she's hitting so hard because she has uh, the whatever this stuff is. Dude, Genus, I need you to be in the back, bro. Please be more in the back. Uh, where is it? Life bottle. Ooh. Ow! Um, can you do another apple gel? Hey, I prepared your sandwich. Oh, I lost grade for that? Come on. Can't be. Fine. Then I'll set this monster free and let it kill you. You know we could stop that, right? No. Not again. Do I have to kill another innocent victim? Wait! Where'd it go? <laughs> is Kelia safe? Kelia is... Don't worry. It seems your real daughter is fine. Lloyd? I see. You. I your name's Lloyd? Yeah. Professor Sage, please. Help him. We finally use cure on somebody. And it doesn't work, does it? <laughs> Gosh. Please. Please save Chocolat. That poor girl. She was just used as a tool to lure you out. Card key. The passcode is three. Got it. And I know this is a selfish request, but if you somehow find a way to save my wife, please help her return to our human form. When my daughter comes back, I don't want her to be all alone. Okay. Okay. I promise. Thank you. Let's get going. Kratos, how can you just say that? We need to leave. Settle down, Lloyd. What is it that we must do now? Rescue Chocolat, then defeat Magnus, the leader of this region. Exactly. Yeah, I know. You're right, I'm sorry. Let's go, Lloyd. Let's defeat the designs. My healing arts cannot even save one single life. Professor Sage, did you say something? No, it's nothing. Well, at least they all disappeared. Looking for... Wait, can I go into the wall? I'm going into the wall. <sighs> Anything? No.
I thought we'd get a better grade from that fight, honestly. He's a father? Why'd you light a door? Because I felt sorry for him. I couldn't tell someone about to die that his daughter was no longer alive, you know? I, I know what you mean, but I wonder if maybe he realized it anyway. What? Then why did he ask me? Why would he ask me? I think it's because he's a father. A father. There's no parent that doesn't wish for the well-being of their children. Yep. I wonder if my parents were the same way. They were. I might want to rest up a bit. <laughs> And then we can head out. 